welcome to this BuyBot Pro video. So in today's video, I want to show you how to work out variations from using BuyBot Pro. So let's get stuck straight in. There are two different types of variations. Well, there's probably a lot more, but there's two main different types of variations. And they are variations like this. So this is called a parent-child variation. So you've got all your different products and you've got lots of different colors, you've got lots of different sizes, but no matter which one you click on, you'll find that the title of the product stays exactly the same. So you therefore know that that's a, a parent-child uh, listing and it doesn't matter which one, as I say, whichever one you click on, it stays exactly the same, the title stays the same. So let me show you how to do that within, within Buybot Pro. So the first thing to do is obviously to analyze your deal. And then if you come down and have a look, you've got an extra feature in Buybot Pro here called Show Variations. So one of the things you should do is straight away enable that and go along to your review count and sort it so you've got your highest review count at the top. So now let's have a look down and we can have a look at the estimated sales for this product. So this product's got estimated sales of about four. So it's a very slow selling product. If we come down a bit further, you'll be able to see that in the chart as well. So there's the BuyBot Pro chart showing you the sales. Now, so we, we're only selling four. Now, if you could have complete control of that, that might, that might be okay for you and, and you know how your business and how your business works. But if we look at this review percentage and it works on the basis like, Amazon don't disclose obviously how many people give reviews, but if I kind of tend to work on like one in a hundred people might do a review or something like that. So not very many people get reviews. So it's, you're never gonna build up a huge amount unless it's a massively selling product. But what I'm interested in here is look at these percentages of who's got the review. So the Black one's got the highest percentage at 8.24. Black size four is clearly the most popular, 8.24% of the reviews. But they, all the way down to here, there's, yeah, there's a difference. Obviously, this is only at 3.53. But it's not like this one's at 60% and then these are all at 5%. And then you'd have a very clear winner in terms of which product was the most popular in terms of reviews. So here I can see clearly that there are quite a few that have got reviews um, and have been purchased. So it, this to me would straight away, unless this was a super fast seller, which we can sell it, we can see it's not because the estimated sales tell us it's four and the chart shows us that it's not a particularly fast seller as well. So that wouldn't be a product that I would buy because straight away I can see that I'd have to buy so many of them to be able to cover all the different eventualities of what's fairly popular and it's still only selling for a month so it wouldn't be a product that i would be interested in buying but as i say that's called a parent child asin now as you click on these the information in the chart will change and the information within buybot pro will change but the one thing that doesn't change is the bsr so the chart will look different but the bsr will stay the same so you need to make sure that you bear that in mind when you're sourcing with child parent child variations so everything will change apart from the bsr now there's a different type of variation as well and there's a variation like this one and you can see that if i click on a different one the title changes so this is called a merged variation and what will happen then if i analyze this deal so let's analyze that deal and have a look. We can see we've got either a pack of one or just a, just a single one, or we've got a pack of three. So we can go down and have a look at the sales. So it's selling fairly well. It's not super fast, but it's selling 16 a month on average. So it is at least selling. So if you now have a look at the variations and do as I said with the review count, we can see straight away that the pack of three has got 85% of the reviews. So clearly the pack of three is a lot more popular than the individual one. And you can back that up by having a look at the chart. So let's come down to the chart. And if we have a look at all time, now I'm on the individual listing at the moment. And can you see this massive drop in BSR 
in May 2020. This is when Amazon merged the listings together. So they merged the BSR of the one pack and the three pack together. And you can see here on this one, before that day, the one pack is selling just once in a blue moon. And the BSR is going up and up and up and up and then boom, all the way back down here because it's been merged with the three pack, which we've already worked out is selling much quicker because we've seen that in the review percentage in the variation feature in Buybot Pro. So if we now go on to the three pack and have a look at the chart again, and let's look at all time, there we can see that backed up again. Look how fast that product is selling and it's consistently sold well before May 2020 when the, it merged. And obviously that forced this one to go up a bit because it went in the wrong direction because it suddenly got merged with one that wasn't selling very much. But before that, you can see it's selling super fast. So that's the difference between a merged and a parent child variation. So if you're buying this one, absolutely buy the three pack because it sells much quicker. And personally, I'd stay away from this one altogether because there's not enough variation in the percentage of reviews and it doesn't have quick enough sales to support those different variations. So that would be my suggestion and that's how I look at variations within Buybot Pro. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and we'll keep showing you how Buybot Pro can make a world of difference in your online arbitrage business.